let's say we're going to keep what I want is I want to be able to get some red circles on this side of my canvas, a line just in the middle and maybe blue squares on this side. And it's all going to happen on mouse press. Open a mouse press. I'm going to start with my if mouse pressed and bring it down a few lines and close it. So that's ready. And now I can start adding my specific if mouse's x is in a certain location within these brackets. Okay, so if mouse x, let's start with the first one. Let's say I wanted it to be, if my screen is 800 by 800, so that means 400 is the middle, and I only want it to go to 300. So if mouse x is less than 300, open curly bracket, I want to have a fill. I already forgot what colors I said. Uh, I'm going to say red. I don't know, red over here. And I want it to be a circle that I am drawing with. And, oh, let's just bring in some random. Why not? Let's uh, have a little random fun. We'll make that a little bigger. Sure. And I need my closing bracket, okay? So this is one if statement. So I will only get this circle if my mouse X is less than 300. And my mouse is, well. I am getting it while I'm over here, but once my mouse X hits 300, it stops drawing. And I did not make any specifications about the Y, so I get it the whole space. All right, so if this is 300, and now I'm gonna skip the middle for a second, and we're gonna do the other side. I'll do some blue squares that I want to draw from 500 and over. I need to be outside or after that closing bracket. I don't need to say if mouse pressed again, I just needed that once, but this will say if mouse X is greater than 600, is that what I said? 500 I think, is greater than 500 Get my open curly bracket, then I want to have a blue square. Ugh. Sorry. And I'll just make it a pick size. And I need to close that out. All right, I'll just add a little space here so you can see the different statements. So this is all wrapped in an if mouse pressed. That closes down here. That's the closing for this one up here. Then I have an if mouse x is less than 300, it opens, it closes. If mouse x is greater than 500, opens and closes, I get a square. So let's test this out. Here I get my circle. And over here, once I am greater than 500, I get my blue square. So now let's think about what do we need to do if we wanna get something in the middle. This needs to be a longer statement because basically I need it to be greater than 300 and less than 500. So again, I'm after this closing bracket of my, the last if statement. So another one, if mouse X is greater than 300 and that's two ands, mouse Y is less than 500. So I'm in that in-between area open curly bracket and I'm going to just take a, I'll put in a line with like a black stroke. Okay. So here need, so if this is working correctly, you should have three closing brackets at the end. One for the draw, one for the if mouse pressed and one for your last if statement. So now I am here, I'm drawing with this one. And now in the middle is the only spot I get the line. And then, oh, wait, my line is going past that. So something is not right. I put mouse Y. That's why. My mistake. Test it out here. I'm less than 300. I get my red. I get my line when I'm in the middle. And I get the blue when I'm over here.
x-axis. And just for the sake of example, let's make it a little bit more specific. I can only draw the red once I am um, lower than 100 pixels on the y-axis. And maybe um, I'm greater than 600 pixels or something like that on the y-axis. Statement that allowed me to draw on the left-hand side with the red circle. I'm going to go inside my parenthesis and I'm just going to add more arguments. I get to be as argumentative as I want and make it very, very picky. So and mouse y is, let's say, greater than 100 and mouse y is less than, I don't know, 700. So now my mouse has to be between 100 and 700 on the y-axis and less than 300 on the x-axis to be able to get my... Okay, so it won't draw all the way up there and it won't go all the way down to the bottom. All right, and if the other side to the blue square, I'll add that in there and mouse y is greater than 100 to ands and mouse y is less than, what did I say up there, 700. All right, so it's a very long specific statement. So this, it stops there, I get my middle stuff, and then this, same thing. Okay, so in the next one, we'll review how to do things on the left map.